How's the brightness? SGC here, we're back for a food tasting. Bam! This is lots. I don't know. It's Korean. And the nutritional facts at the back, this is labeled as a O I N G. So, Ong, Oing, Biscuit, Biscuit Oing. I don't, I don't know. It's, it's right there. But it's strange. I mean, we have a kettlefish and then we have a shrimp. So I'm like, make up your mind, people. Like, is this kettlefish or shrimp? I, I don't really know. But it, it doesn't say starch, wheat flour, squid extract, and shrimp. So I guess there is shrimp and squid in here. Like there's a sh shrimp holding a piece of itself and telling you that it's amazing. There's there's a little shrimp up here. There's another shrimp down there, and more more of that in the back. So what do I expect? I don't know. I don't really know. But anyway, I just open up and see how it goes. I mean, it feels like it's up here. Whoops. It feels like it's up here. So in terms of packaging, it's pretty not fooling you with air, but rather it has stuff. So anyway, let's, let's open this. Okay. Sniffing it, you smell the shrimp. Like if you had those shrimp crackers that... If you go to a party and some Chinese Asian person brings something, that orange bag of just shrimp, like sticks, it's like that. There's some squid in here. So here, this is it. This is how it looks like. So if you know what I'm talking about, for the, don't know what I'm talking about for the shrimp stuff, it's like this, but white and there's stripes in it. But anyway, this is, this is, this is happening. It's the shrimp squid thing. Initial taste tastes like a shrimp cracker, but the aftertaste has a squid-like taste to it. Pretty easy to eat, people. But I'm wondering about this aftertaste effect where you just keep eating it, or you just keep tasting the shrimp more than the squid. Though, who am I kidding? I'm not worried. Just just keep eating. So this was gifted to me. And I would definitely say that's a good price, whatever they paid. Because there's hardly any air in this. There's no trickery. As in, like, sometimes when you buy stuff, there's a lot of air. When you open the back, it's only down here. But it's like three quarters full. That's not bad. So, tastes like shrimp trackers. I really wish there was more squid flavor in this. But then again, having squid and shrimp, squish, squish, shrimp, in it, it's sort of like wine. I'm gonna wonder how I'm gonna name this. This will be lot. Onion biscuit, shrimp, squid, cracker. It's a curious, interesting sort of com collaboration of these two tastes, and I'm sort of bummed that it's not. I don't know. I sort of wish there was more squid taste to this, because that would be different. Shrimp, had it all the time with shrimp crackers. This one, not so much. Like, if it was squid, and then you had an aftertaste of shrimp, that would be cool, because then I would actually get this over a shrimp cracker. So yeah, I mean, there's a slight tinge of saltiness in the beginning, but as you eat more and more of it, it, it just tastes like shrimp crackers. So that is it. Tasting, food tasting of lots, oing, biscuit, biscuit, oing. I'm probably saying it wrong, but I don't know why they, they, they wrote it like that. They, they, they wrote it like that. So I'm not going crazy. But anyway, that is it. 
I don't know. How do I even outro these things anymore? I don't remember. I don't do it often enough. But anyway, that is it, and that is it for this food tasting. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>